So today I'm walking through one of the most trusted trend reports on earth, which is the Etsy trend report, the only trend report that you need to pay attention to if you want to sell successfully on Etsy, if you want to know what to sell. So what I have done with the 2022 trend report is I've literally gone through to really signify and help you to highlight the ideas that Etsy has given you. And I was amazed. Etsy has given us so many ideas across six different categories. Whilst I love talking about digital products. I recognize that not everybody wants to do digital products, but you still want to have a shop on somewhere like Etsy and you want to do it successfully, but you're wondering, what can I sell in a different space? Perhaps you want to sell something in the paper and party supply space. If that is the case, then you, you're definitely on the right video because in this video, I'm diving into the Etsy trend of 2022 to dish out the goods, read between the line and share with you everything that you need to know about what Etsy recommends in this space. So without further ado, let me share for a moment. If you are, if this is your first time on this channel, I'm Pamela Bassa, the founder of The Lucrative Lady. And on this channel, I talk all things sales, sales systems, social media, and strategy. And one of the, one of my favorite strategies is of course, digital products and Etsy as a platform, hence this video. So if you like what you see, please go ahead, subscribe, turn on your bell, and of course, share this video. My, now my OGs who are coming back to the channel, thank you so much for coming back. Let's dive right in. So paper and party supplies category. This is a really fun category for me um, as well. Again, we start by looking at this already. I can see a lot of pastel colors. I can see that emerald green is coming through here. I like how they have used it. Emerald green is the uh, Etsy color of the year, right? I can see how they have put things together. I'm liking this. It's given me a lot of um, ideas. So let's read and get some more ideas from the trend. So what I love about this category is that Instantly, it's giving me ideas. So goal setting, boom, that's a product idea. It's saying shoppers tend to fresh calendars, planners, and journals to start the new year on an optimistic, organized note. And not just the new year, but throughout the year. Offer creative solutions for tackling the day and routine. So anything that helps people tackle routine, that's a product, guys. From downloadable, downloadable meal planning template to display worthy to-do list. Look how simple it is. I mean, I'm just going to pull this through. This is my menu uh, plan that I have just sitting on the wall in my kitchen. I follow a menu. Yes, I am. Yes, I am that sad. Um, we follow a menu in this house. This is how we eat well. Um, but yes, this is how I stay sane. But, but yes, I could package this and sell this as a digital product is what, let me put it back. That was louder than I planned. Um, I could package and sell that template um, is what Etsy is really trying to say. Downloadable meal planning templates. You see that? Uh, what I love about digital products specifically is that a lot of the stuff that you can sell really well are already in your home. That's what I really love about it. So here it goes, occasion and gifting. Again, idea. Paper and party supplies is a top category for Valentine's Day, Mother's Day, as demand for decor, wrapping paper, gift bags, flourishes. Also consider offering digital items, buyers can purchase and download in a last minute pinch. Oh, I just love Etsy and I love this category. Occasion and greeting cards, that's another category under the um, paper and party supplies. With many people still spending Christmas and milestone moments apart, we're still seeing increased demand for thoughtful cards to bridge the distance. Also consider needs for everyday greetings and try offering personalized option. I second this actually. Personalized option, really, really good. People are looking for cards that look like them right? Cards with, with faces that look like them, right? Um, people are looking for cards in other languages, greetings that are a little bit different than just happy birthday. They want greetings that really um, signify what it is that they want to say from their heart. It says there's a 21,166% year-on-year -year increase in searches on Etsy for teacher greeting card. Who knew? That would make a really good shop on Etsy. Birthday card was a top search among male shoppers in early 2021. How interesting. Textured perfection. Introduce natural edges to add tactile intrigue to your items or use upcycled materials for raw and unfinished feel. Some ideas there for you. Retro influences saying 70s inspired color palettes, nostalgic fonts and quirky patterns are expected to attract tr shoppers this year, 2022. Again, another thing that's attracting shoppers, it's tropical prints, which as we go into spring and summer, 
I'm all for it. Tropical prints and geometric patterns, mystical creatures, children's trends, enter a magical realm with fan, uh, fantastical creatures like dragons and fairies. Look to these themes to become big for kids' birthday party supplies. You see that? Massive 24% year-on-year increase in searches on Etsy for dragon toys. So if you are thinking about getting into the paper and party supplies space, there is so much here for you just from reading the Etsy trends alone. There's so much you can do. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you got some value from that. Even if you didn't think that this was a category for you, share the video because you might be helping somebody else who um, you know, is looking for ideas in this specific uh, category. You'll be doing the world a wealth of good and of course myself. If you are just getting started selling digital products or selling on Etsy, then you're going to want to grab my digital product starter kit. This is a really important document that gives you everything you need to know. In it, I share my top 100 uh, products to sell on Etsy. I also share the different formats that your products need to be so that you're able to upload them very, very easily and generate sales really fast. And lastly, I also share with you 14 different ways to sell your products. You do not want to miss it. And it is absolutely free. So there is no cost. You want to look for it in the description of this video. Make sure you get access to that and get started with my digital product starter kit. It's really good to have had you and make sure you check out this playlist where I share um, a, a lot of other things that I'm learning about, you know, uh, digital products. We've made multiple six figures from digital products and, you know, running uh, a shop on Etsy, etc. So make sure that you check out this playlist and I'll see you in my next video.